42 Matto Section 1 The world is maintained by two colors only Rabbi Yehuda and Rabbi Yitzhak talk about the wise hearted women that spin and work with their hands and from this they derive that those women combine judgment and mercy we hear that Rabbi Lazar said that every woman is considered judgment until she marries a man of Israel who is compassion and thus judgment and mercy are joined together the rabbis explain why it is forbidden for men to have intercourse with women from the other nations we hear that God called the souls of Israel Jesus so that the world would never be without love from this it is clear that anyone who destroys Jesus will not exist in the world to come Matto ends with a reference to Levi right marriage where the childless man's brother restores Jesus to the world one but all the women children that have not known man by lying with him Imid bar 3118 in relation to this we learn that Rabbi Yehuda said the world is maintained by Two colors only white and red, namely Shesedim and Shachma of the left that come from the aspect of the wise-hearted woman hence it says and all the women that were wise-hearted did spin with their hands and brought that which they had spun both of blue and of purple Shema 3525 what did they bring the scripture says blue and purple which are colors contained within colors that is there are two main colors, white and red, and blue and purple colors are included within these two colors. Two this is the meaning of she seeks wool and flax and works willingly with her hands Mishlei 113 since wool pertains to the right and mercy and flax to the left and judgment it is also written did spin with their hands what is spin Rabbi Yehuda says they spin with judgment and they spin with mercy that is they interlace right and left with each other and the judgments of the left are sweetened by the mercy of the right Rabbi Yitzhak said why is a woman Hebisha so called which is derived. From fire Hebesh he said to him she contains judgment and mercy she is therefore called Isha the letters of Esh Hayesh being judgment and Hey mercy three come and behold Rabbi Lazar said every woman is considered to be of judgment since they are rooted in the left column it is so until she tastes the taste of mercy that is marries a man as a male is rooted in the right column which is Jesus and mercy we learn that it is from the side of the man that white is produced such as the bones of the fetus for he is of mercy from the side of the woman comes the red of the fetus the red of flesh and sinew which are of judgment when a woman tastes of the white that is when she is married to a man white is more predominant in her though her root is the red for come and behold this is why women of the other nations who know man by lying with him are forbidden to be wed we have learned that there is right Jesus and left judgment which are Israel and the other. Nations and also the Garden of Eden on the right and Gehenna on the left. This world is on the left and the world to come is on the right. The children of Israel correspond to mercy on the right and the other nations to judgment on the left. We have learned that when a woman has a taste of mercy, that is when she marries one of the men of Israel. Mercy overpowers judgment and she turns into mercy when a woman has a taste of judgment. That is when she marries a foreigner who pertains to judgment. As mentioned, judgment cleaves to judgment. The judgment in the woman adheres to the judgment in the foreigner. It is written of them. The dogs are insolently greedy. They never have enough. Yeshayah 5611. Five in relation to this, we have learned that a woman who is married to a foreigner is attached to him like a dog. Just as a dog has a strong impudent spirit, she who is married to a foreigner is also most impudent. When judgment cleaves to judgment, we learn that she who is married to one of the children of Israel, it says of her, but you that did cleave to Hashem, your Elohim are alive. Every one of you, the state of Aram 44, what is the reason thereof? The soul of Israel comes from the spirit of living Elohim is written, but the spirit should faint also enveloped before me. Yeshea 5716, this is understood from the phrase before me, which means from before the Sheshan, namely from Zeir and been called living Elohim, therefore in the virgin woman who does not cleave to the harsh judgment of the other nations as mentioned above, but cleaves to Israel, which is of mercy. Mercy is more powerful, and she is corrected from the judgment in her six come, and behold, it is written, for I have said, the world is built by Jesus. Talim 893, what is Jesus? He answers, it is one of the king's supernal Sphirot, namely the highest of the lower seven Sphirot, for the Holy One, blessed be he named the soul of Israel, Jesus, on the condition that it would build Jesus, thus Jesus will never cease. This is derived from the phrase is built which refers to Chesed that will be built we have therefore learned that he who causes Chesed to cease in the world will perish in the world to come hence it is written the wife of the dead shall not marry abroad to a stranger Devarim 255 in order to do kindness Chesed with the dead man so that he will be built and established as it is written the world is built by Chesed Tehillim 893.